Newcastle kick off. The ball's high across into the uh, to about 10 metre. Just taken by Julian Horobin. He uh, marches forward. Dawson passes back to Jess Harris, who hoists the high ball. The commentary uh, backs chasing Rob Robinson. Touched back by Matt Gallagher, but taken by Andy Stimson. Across from Andrew, across to Tetelo, uh, who passes to uh, John Bentley, but he's pulled forced down. The ball goes into touch. It's a line out to Coventry. Dave Adelton, the Coventry hooker, getting ready to uh, throw the ball in. There's the ball in there. And uh, Patton looked like a knock forward by Patton. But uh, a little bit of uh, referee cousin signals the scrum. In by Gary Armstrong. The scrum looks fairly solid. And basically, referee cousins has whistled. The pack, packs disengage. Referee cousins, cousins warming. Armstrong in again with the, uh, the scrum. Roar from the crowd. Referee cousins has signalled uh, feeding. And there's chatting back from one of the Newcastle players. Referee Cousins marches in back 10. It's quickly taken by Derek Eves. And a high tackle there by Newcastle captain Dean Ryan. Referee Cousins stops the Coventry forwards as they attempt to uh, march through. He's awarded the uh, speaking to Dean Ryan and signalled that it was a high tackle on Derek Eves. And Jez Harris has signalled he'd like a shot at uh, goal with a penalty just about the 22 metre mark. Here's the packed stands here at Cannon Road, the Coventry's biggest crowd for some years, over 7,500 we believe here, here today. Jez Harris lining up the penalty just about the 22 metre mark, attacking the city end, taking his time as he normally does with his lining up these uh, kicks. And Jez Harris now striking up and there it's straight through the posts, a lead for Coventry, Coventry three points, Newcastle nil. Been a good start by Coventry, they've taken the game to Newcastle. Back, Armstrong again. Yeah, to Andrew. Finds uh, Andrew Blythe, strong runner. But the ball's come loose. There is Matt Tetlow going down on the ball. Referee Cousins has signalled. Uh, he's awarded a penalty to Newcastle. Not yes, and it's uh, Rob Andrew, Newcastle's director of rugby, but also excellent goal kicker who's going to attempt to uh, level the scores. Coventry currently leading three points to nil, just uh, receiving sand just to uh, make it uh, a better chance of uh, kicking this uh, goal to level the scores. Don't forget Coventry lead through the Jess Harris penalty, an early penalty. But, um, Newcastle got a chance here to level the scores. This packed crowd of enjoying this all action stuff. Andrew, a very, very confident kicker. I think. Uh, uh, I would put in my house on him to get this uh, this penalty here. And there it goes. Yes, a successful signal by the touch judges. And thank God my house is safe. Coventry three points. Newcastle three points. Jess Harry three points. Rob Andrew three points. Hooker. Back by Dawson. There goes Harris. Rob Robinson. Eves trying to barrel his way through. He uh, sets it back. Dawson to, to Harris. The Horobin is up there. He's uh, ch charged down. The ball's back again. Dawson to Harris. Crane. Ball gone back. Referee cousin signal a penalty. Advantage to Coventry. Whatever happens here, they can probably take a chance of a penalty. And he's right. awarded the penalty offside against Newcastle. And still, still awarded a penalty. Not ten. You can see the, the marquee at the back. Jez Harris signalled that he's going to attempt to regain the lead for Coventry with a penalty. Uh, referee Dean Ryan squaring the uh, decision from referee Cousins. Uh, disputing the, uh, or just querying, shall we say, the, uh, the decision. Jez Harris just lining up a fairly safe bet, I should imagine, to actually restore Coventry's lead 6 3. He's in front, attacking the city end. Lines up, line right footed, there it goes, safely through the post. Coventry six points, Newcastle three points. It's Rob Andrew with the restart. Kicks forward. Has gone ten. Back by Grucock to Horobin to Eves. To a pattern, charging through. And the ball's back. Not, not releasing by uh, the judge by Patton. 
Andrew taking it quickly. Out. Oh, but knocked forward by Dean Ryan as he, uh, as he tried to uh, take the charge forward. Little uh, Hooker Adelton having a few uh, few words and uh, exchanging a few pleasantries with uh, Ryan. But Newcastle have been awarded a penalty. And of course, Andrew, as he has done so many times in the past, he elects to uh, kick for goal. Is behind position behind the uh, the goal. Andrew lines up this uh, short penalty just past the 22 meter mark, 22 meter line, and it's Andrew with that familiar crouch style, which has been more evident over the years. There he got successful. Comedy six points. Newcastle six points. Jez Harris six points. Rob Andrew six, and the ball in the shape in the hands of Rob Andrew kicks finds touch safely good kick so it's the line out going to be just just about halfway on the uh, pitch going to be a line out it was a, a kick to touch by Rob Andrew for a full penalty it'll be a Newcastle throw in Newcastle hooker Ross Nesdale with the uh, the ball. The ball's in. Back by Weir to Armstrong to Andrew. There's John Bentley coming in field, taking the ball at the pace. And there's held up there by this comedy defence. And it, the, the, it's forming there, the rook. Back by Armstrong again. Whoops, that was a bit of a slight of pass by Underwood there. Missed it. I think he missed his footing as well, but he fell on the ground. But they're basically Newcastle started again through Armstrong. Terrific pressure starting to build up now by Newcastle as they gain momentum. There goes uh, Prop Popperwell, Nigel Popperwell. He's charging through, setting up again. The ball seems to have gone forward there. No, a penalty awarded. Obviously, referee because he decided that Derek Eves was a uh, signal actually playing the ball at the rook with a hand, which I thought so. Uh, I think that's Derek Eves just questioning uh, this uh, remark. Rob Andrew again going to uh, line up for, to take the lead possibility of the Newcastle taking the lead for the first time in this game. The kick from about uh, 17 metres. Andrew has all already landed to, uh, two penalties in the game. Now should have a chance to uh, make give uh, his third penalty, land his third penalty, and give Newcastle the lead for the first time. Yes, that successful penalty. So the score now changes. Comedy six points. Newcastle nine points. Bit of a blow there to uh, Coventry after they seem to be doing. It's going to be a Coventry throw in. Booker Adelton, the man with the ball at the moment. So the line out is steady. Back by, oh, they're tapped back by Ryan. But again, Mark Crane uh, tidies it up. We're back, coming back on the Coventry side. So they're going to try and work this ball out to Dawson. Harris hoists it forward. High ball, high hanging ball. Well taken by John Bentley, who runs running back. Oh, a tap tackle there by Richie Robinson. Almost caused problems. Back to Underwood. And he, he kicks and tries to find touch, but doesn't find touch. Back to Eves in the hands of Eves. The man just waiting there again, charging forward. Sets it up. Back comes the ball on the company side. To Harris, charging through. Back to Patton. Looked like a Newcastle attack from the wrong side there, but basically still charging onto the line, causing terrific pressure. Referee Cousins signalled penalty to Coventry. Not releasing. Back quickly taken penalty, the ball's a lot. No. It starts again. They try to charge through. Terrific amount of pressure. Referee Cousins saying that. Uh, Player has been held up, so the ball, the put in at the scrum, will go to Newcastle. Uh, good chance there for Coventry to try to cross the line, but good defence by Newcastle, you have to say that. This side, in by Armstrong, two steady uh, packs there. Out to Armstrong, and he finds, no, he doesn't find touch. Uh, for a player who is standing, to, not to find touch is quite surprising. Kilford across, he finds Robinson. He's 
He's, Andrew was in there. The ball's out again. Eves again trying to trying to create pressure. He's challenged by Doddy Weir. Rook forms. Crane tackled then some tackling going on here. Out to uh, Patton. He's charging through. Hardwick darts out of the way. The ball set back again. Charging forward is Adelton now. Again. Out. Gallagher. Oh, good tackle there. But it could be offside. Yes, it is. Referee couldn't single offside again. Quickly taken there by Gallagher. Across to Horobin. And to winger Wayne Kilford, who scores a try in the corner. Magnificently quickly taken penalties by Coventry there. Try, first try of the match to Wayne Kilford. We stretch the Newcastle defence. So much pressure building up on that Newcastle line. Crowd terrifically happy there. See? First try of the game. Conversion attempt to come. At the moment, the score is Coventry 11 points, Newcastle 9 points. Uh, I think there's uh, a few uh, heart uh, palpitations in the crowd, and also certainly the players are giving all their all on both sides in this game today. And the attempt by Jez Harris, close to the touchline. As Kilford scored, squeezed into the corner, just on the 22, lining up the uh, attempt at the uh, conversion. So he runs up to the ball now, smacks it, looks it good, but no, just goes across the face of the uh, the posts. So misses there, score stays, Coventry 11 points, Newcastle 9 points. Terrific entertainment here. Shaking some of the loudspeakers there. Ross Nesdale with the uh, throw in. Doddy Weir, top palms back safely. Armstrong to Andrew. There held. Oh, something's gone on here. Oh, I could punching by John Bentley on the uh, country left winger Andrew Smallwood. Players, uh, referee has uh, se separated the players. The touch judge on the, the uh, stand side has signalled something has gone on. Looked like a, a punch by uh, Bentley. Bentley just being spoken to. Referee Cousins pushes Bentley away as uh, Bentley tries to make his case for the defence. But uh, it's going to be a yellow card offence. No, sorry, it's a red card offence. John Bentley, Newcastle right winger, rugby league player as well as until the play comeback for Newcastle, has been sent from the field. It's the 39th minute of the game. Newcastle have been reduced to 14 men. John Bentley, right winger, sent off for a punching offence. On. Andy Smallwood. There he's off. And McAdam. Dawson. Foot in touch there. There's, a, there's got to be a touch there. And Char Bibble still charging in. Crofts. Just come on for uh, Andy Blackmore. Instantly making his uh, present felt with uh, a little bit of a dispute with one of the Newcastle players. Referee Cousins having a word with uh, the hooker Nesdale and Crofts. Crofts on for the injured Blackmore. This is a little bit of a halting play while uh, hooker Adelton receives uh, treatment from uh, the physio Jackie. Carl uh, Coventry. Uh, the line out taken now. Off the top, back by Armstrong. Armstrong across. Andrew finds O'Neill. He's charging through. He's held by Eves. It looks like Jez Harris there. In trying to, trying to stop this Newcastle momentum gaining. Back to Armstrong, to Andrew. Kick charge down. But Coventry are offside. Oh, that's Crofts has gone through there. A dispute with Weir and Crofts. Looks like uh, Crofts was a, a little bit over eager then. He's already been spoken to. Could well be a yellow card here for Crofts. And it is. Lee Crofts only on for a few minutes. As a replacement for Andy Blackmore, he's earned the dubious distinction of a yellow card. So it's a penalty to Newcastle. Andrew has signalled or spoken to referee Cousins and said that he wants a, a go at the post to uh, give Newcastle the lead again. If this would make it, if this was successful, this would make it Coventry 11 points, Newcastle 12 points. A few booing. Uh, a few people booing in the crowd about the decision, but uh, looked at 
clear case of uh, over eagerness by Crofts. But Andrew lining up this uh, penalty attempt, probably about 38 metres. Attacking the city end now in the second half. Swings his right foot in that familiar crack style, and it's there. Newcastle have the lead back again. Coventry 11 points, Newcastle 12 points. By Julian Horobin. All taken off there by, by Dean Ryan. Taken on now by Weir. Oh, the referee has awarded a penalty to Newcastle. Quickly taken. Ryan running at to uh, running through Harris, not to not actually uh, round him. Ball set up again. Pressure the Newcastle are exerting now it must be tremendous. Picked up there by Andrew, then playing scrum half. But back again. There's Andrew again to Armstrong. This darting little player. Could be a very much a problem if he gets a bit of space. And Hardwick back on the pitch now. After his uh, stitches. Ball in by Armstrong. Picked up by Ryan again, who uh, seems to be the main focal point of uh, Newcastle play. Back to Andrew. Across. Across there to Matt Tetlow. Picked up by Gareth Archer. For the, for the uh, loose pass inside. Now Newcastle putting the pressure on here. Terrific dance and Andrew lining up a drop goal, but he had second thoughts. Tackled by Eves, who was there to uh, stop him. The ball there. Newcastle Graham back to Armstrong again. There's Tony Unwood coming inside. Must have been cold on that left wing, not receiving the ball. Picked up now by Nick Popperwell, the Irish uh, prop, which are uh, trying to charge through. Back here by Armstrong. Terrific pressure here by Newcastle. The man, Coventry manfully holding out. Penalty to Newcastle. Coming round offside by Coventry. Terrific defence there was uh, at the time, but uh, now it's a penalty to Newcastle. Chance for them to extend their lead, which would make it Coventry 11 points, Newcastle 15 points if Rob Andrew is successful with his penalty attempt. Crowd there, watching intensely watching this game. There, hoisted over, landed by Rob Andrew. So the score: the Coventry 11 points, Newcastle 15 points. And tosses the ball over to uh, Dawson. Dawson with the put in, and the ball I believe is coming back on the Coventry side. Picked up by Patton. He's held. Yes, line offside. Hardwick takes it on. I believe there's going to be another knock 10. Because Newcastle will knock 10. Bryant. Eves takes it on. Patton. He's held. Dawson. Harris. Gallagher. Andy Smallwood. Andy Smallwood's there from the line. He slides in. Another Coventry try, their second of the match, Andy Smallwood. What an exciting game this is becoming now. The first to come, it's now Coventry, 16 points. Newcastle, 15 points. That was super play there for Coventry. Quick taking penalties, put the pressure on Newcastle, always on the back foot. Finally, across the left winger, Andy Smallwood. in that um, incident with John Bentley in the first half which resulted in uh, John Bentley getting sent off and uh, Bentley threw punches however that was uh, some while ago now Coventry have the lead conversion attempt here from Jez Harris close to the touchline looks like that's going to be short wasn't short, but it was just wide across the post. Still, it's there. Coventry now leading. Coventry 16 points. Newcastle 15. The excitement is growing here. 
Newcastle previously in beaten. They've won all their games, apart from the draw at Richmond. Now restart again, all gone dead, line out. However, the referee has said that there's going to be a set scrum. They're not forward, Newcastle will have the put in. Chance of a drop goal here, possibility from Rob Andrew. We'll have a see. Armstrong back. This is the base of the scrum with Dean Ryan, Newcastle's number eight and captain. No, Ryan picks it up, charges through, it's held. There's the ball, picked up by Gareth Archer, he charges forward. He's trying to get the ball, oh, back to Armstrong. With Andrew down, no drop goal attempt this time. Ball back. There's O'Neill, charging forward, but held by Patton. Armstrong. Again, the defence is there. There's numbers. This is this is a terrific game. Ball back. Out to Ryan. A little <laughs> sighter for Andrew, and it's there. The drop goal from Rob Andrew. Newcastle have got the lead back again. Coventry 16 points, Newcastle 18 points, Armstrong kicked it. This is a terrific tussle. Allerton with a throw in. There it is, back by Crane. Dawson to Harris, to Horobin. Do it looks like a high tackle there. But no. There's Harris, finding Kilford. There goes Patton charging through, this long Bristol in number eight. Brucock charges on. Commentary trying to get back to something there. Drop goal attempt from Harris. Just wide of the post. Whoa. Deep into the time adding on now, I believe. We're getting very close. Referee Cousins looks at his watch. Can't be much left. This drama here. Newcastle with a two-point lead. Commentary 16, Newcastle 18. Andrew with the restart. There goes the ball. It's high. It's gone straight out. That shows you how much tension there is out there. Andrew normally unflappable. Puts the ball straight out on the pull. And the Coventry put in at the scrum. Could be, I wonder. Could we see another Harris drop goal attempt? We shall see. There is Dawson with the put in. We're back by Dawson. No, across to Harris. Oh, he's gone down there to uh, Wayne Kilford. And the ball is back on, on the Newcastle side. Clearance. Archer back to Stimson. He kicks it forward. Not fair touch. But got, not gone forward either from McAdam. He charges inside. Patton. Tackled. It's going to be a scrum to Newcastle. The referee said the ball had gone forward. So it's Newcastle. With the put in. Gary Armstrong with the ball waiting. Be back again from the footed foot of Dean Ryan. No, the scrum has actually wheeled again, so it'll be another set scrum. As you were, gentlemen. Armstrong, ball back with Dean Ryan at the foot of the base of the Newcastle pack. Scrum looks again to have wheeled, it has. Could be a little bit time consuming for uh, Newcastle here, but uh, they won't mind that. They're winning by two points. Comedy 16 points, Newcastle 18 points. And there's Ryan again with the ball. Hoisted up by Armstrong. The ball did come out that time. And it's gone straight out again on the full. So it's going to be a line out to Coventry. Adelton waits, gets instructions from his uh, scrum half, Dawson. Short line out here. Grewcock back to Dawson, to Harris, to Gallagher, to Horobin, he's tackled, held up. Ball needs to come back there, Patton. 
Ties it for ball set back. Dawson. Harris with a drop goal attempt. And it's there. Jess Harris restored Coventry's lead. It's Coventry 19, Newcastle 18. What drama. Deep into injury time here. Must have played about three minutes of injury time already. Look at those cheering crowds. They're uh, mostly, obviously, uh, Coventry supporters. Only about 100 or so Newcastle supporters come down from Newcastle. So we can say pass the support here at Counter Road. Coventry have got the lead back again. With that Jez Harris drop goal. With the restart is there. Gone short. He's picked it up. Newcastle fighting for the ball. Coventry want to maintain that ball. There's Wayne Kilford. Hoist it forward, trying to find touch. No, doesn't. Tim Stimson out to Armstrong. Raced by McAdam. Inside to Underwood. Underwood, Underwood comes inside. And it, Mark Crane wraps up. And Tetlow. Oh, a bit of uh, feet, uh, indiscriminate use of the feet there by Gareth Archer. Referee Cousins having a word with him. Couldn't see from where I was who he, that, who he tapped down on. And I believe this will be a, full, a yellow card for Archer. Obviously the tension of, uh, of uh, being uh, at the top. It's getting too much for some of the players. Applauded, full penalty. Into touch. Very, very close to time now. Excitement levels maintained all the way through this game real real top of the table tussle and that's the final whistle referee Cousins has blown full time Coventry have beaten Newcastle full time score Coventry 19 points Newcastle 18 points and look at these scenes here the players throw their shirts to the crowd there's Robinson throwing his Rucott keeping his the crowd have come onto the pitch here Newcastle and Coventry players shake hands. You can tell the Coventry players they're the ones without shirts. But what an absorbing game this was. So much excitement, so much drama. The crowd clapping the, both teams off the pitch because we've seen a terrific game here. There's Dawson hugged by someone, Ticket Dawson. Ian Patton marching off, clapping his hands. Andy Blackmore, unfortunately, came up in the second half. He's hobbling off. He wants to be part of this celebration here. And as you can see, a lot of happy, smiling faces there at Cowden Road.